Peace and blessings, y'all. In this corner, Boston 24. Good evening, good evening. How's everyone doing this evening? Hope everybody's doing well. I'm doing pretty good on this side, as always. God is great. God is good, and I can't complain. All right, so I'm going to get right into it. It looks like the WBC is ordering a fight between Shakur Stevenson, 19-0 with nine knockouts, against Isaac or Isaac Pitbull Cruz, who's 24-2 with 17, 24-2-1 with 17 knockouts. His last fight being a knockout against Ramirez, Eduardo Ramirez. And of course, of course, Stevenson's last fight was at the Prudential Center against Rob Robeson Concia, a fight that I was actually at. And Shakur outboxed him, unanimous decision, the whole fight. Um, so, I remember Shakur Stevenson a couple of months ago was saying that, you know, when he was talking about introduction to 135, or not even a couple of months ago, just recently, no more than a couple of months ago, where he was talking about his introduction to 135 and how he's ready for everybody, Devin, Tank, whomever, you know what I'm saying? And then he was, the interviewer was asked, questioning him, and then he mentioned Isaac Pitbull Cruz, because, of course, Isaac Pitbull Cruz is a rough and rugged fighter, comes in uh, well-prepared, try to knock you out, try to hurt you, try to break you down. And Shakur said, well, you know, I'm going to box his head off. So Shakur mentioned Isaac Cruz, and um, now it looks like the WBC is going to order the fight. And, um, you know, it's going to be a good fight. It's going to be an interesting fight. I think it's a good test for Shakur and his introduction to 135. Because now you're going to be fighting somebody that's strong, got some speed, got a good chin, and he's going to be coming at you. So that's all that's going to really do for Shakur, right, is just perfect his defense even more because he's already a defensive fighter. Now, people might think, well, you know, lately he's been getting touched up a little bit. Just a little bit. Okay, he's been taking some shots, especially in the last fight. He took some shots, but y'all got to remember, you know, Rob Robson Concial is a silver medalist for his country, Brazil. He ain't fighting no bums. So when you're fighting the upper echelon, when you're fighting the better fighters, right, you could be a great fighter, defensive fighter, but you're going to get touched up too. Here or there. But he's still a great fighter, Shakur Stevenson. He's still very defensive. And he's still very offensive when he needs to be. Okay? So Shakur is, listen, I believe that he's going to box his head off, like he said. I think he's going to run box circles around Isaac Cruz. He's going to frustrate him. He's going to beat him down unanimously for the whole fight. Okay? Um, Isaac Cruz, you know, again, rough and rugged fighter. He's coming to fight, but he's definitely in over his head against Shakur. So, you know, it's, 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 um, it's getting ready to go down. And then the winner of the fight is supposed to get Devin Haney. Now, we know that's going to be a goodie because Devin Haney and Shakur got a history, a sparring history, and they're both a little bit older. They're both a little bit stronger, both a little bit smarter. They both got good defense. Um, so that's a 50-50 like that's, that's fight right there, fight that I'd definitely be excited to see. I love both Devin Haney and Shakur Stevenson, you know, but I know 135, he said he's ready. He's going to show out and, you know, Dude's going to have to step up to the plate. They're going to have to show up and show out because Shakur is here. He's at 135 now, all right? So, yeah, that information just came out. We'll see exactly how it goes. But, um, you know, I'm rocking with Shakur on that, on that fight with Isaac Cruz. And um, after that, man, we'll see if he can get that fight with Devin because uh, Devin Haney's supposed to be fighting Lomachenko. So, um, you know, it's interesting. That fight could happen. With him and Devin, I don't know if it'll happen next year, but it's possible, right? Because uh, if Devin Haney fights Lomachenko early last year, next year, and then Shakur Stevenson fights Isaac Cruz, then it's very possible that that fight happens, okay? So um, we're going to see what happens, man. We're going to see how it rolls. And that's all I really got for right now. Um, peace and blessings in this corner box in 24. Everyone, please subscribe to the page. Please leave your comments. Let me know how you feel, how you don't feel. Okay? Um, everybody, please be safe. And everybody, enjoy the rest of your evening. Peace.